An order of magnitude of time is usually a decimal prefix or decimal order of magnitude quantity together with a base unit of time, like a microsecond or a million years. In some cases, the order of magnitude may be implied usually one, like a second or year. In other cases, the quantity name implies the base unit, like century. In most cases, the base unit is seconds or years. Prefixes are not usually used with a base unit of years, so we say a million years, not a megayear. Clock time and calendar time have duodecimal or sexagesimal orders of magnitude rather than decimal, i.e. a year is 12 months, and a minute is 60 seconds. The smallest meaningful increment of time is the Planck time, the time light takes to traverse the Planck distance, many decimal orders of magnitude smaller than a second. The largest realized amount of time, given known scientific data, is the age of the universe, about 13.8 billion years, the time since the Big Bang is measured in the cosmic microwave background rest frame. Those amounts of time together span 60 decimal orders of magnitude. Metric prefixes are defined spanning 10-24 to 1024, 48 decimal orders of magnitude which may be used in conjunction with the metric base unit of second. Metric units of time larger than the second are most commonly seen only in a few scientific contexts such as observational astronomy and materials science although this depends on author. For everyday usage and most other scientific contexts the common units of minutes 60s, hours 3600s or 3.6 kiloseconds, days 86400s, weeks, months, and years of which there are a number of variations are commonly used. Weeks, months and years are significantly variable units whose length crucially depends on the choice of calendar and is often not regular even with a calendar, e.g. leap years versus regular years in the Gregorian calendar. This makes them problematic for use against a linear and regular time scale such as that defined by the SI since it is not clear as to which version of these units we are to be using. Because of this, in the table below we will not use weeks and months and the year we will use is the Julian year of astronomy, or 365.25 days of 86400s exactly, also called an annum and denoted with the symbol A, whose definition is based on the average length of a year of the Julian calendar which had one leap year every and always every four years against common years of 365 days each. This unit is used, following the convention of geological science, to form larger units of time by the application of SI prefixes to it at least up to giga annum, or ga, equal to 1 billion a short scale, 1 billion years, long scale, 1 milliard years. <laughs> Less than one second Topic: One second and longer. In this table, large intervals of time surpassing one second are catalogued in order of the SI multiples of the second, as well as their equivalent in common time units of minutes, hours, days, and Julian years. Topic: See also. Footnotes Notes References External links Exploring time from Planck time to the lifespan of the universe <laughs>